and done the holding and put them into fifth spot Mount Pleasant with the win would consolidate the second place as the teams come out on the field Okay, so as we have told you before, it's Tivoli Gardens here hosting Mount Pleasant. And this is one of the afternoon games here in the Red Stripe Premier League. Man in the middle here today, referee Danian Parchment out of Chilani. FIFA referee he just came from an assignment overseas and one of the top referees here now in the country as both teams give each other cordial greetings. Uh, both teams would have been familiar with each other. These players play all over, sometimes in their communities. So it's Good camaraderie here between both teams and uh, expecting a good quality football game here. So the team news is that Leonardo Rankin coming in from Sanders White House. You would have seen him at Cavalier, but actually was on loan at Cavalier. Is with this Mount Pleasant aggregation at this time. So bright sunny conditions here, uh, uh, a slight breeze over the ground, not uh, total humidity, still hot, but uh, just a slight breeze here to uh, probably bring some comfort, some coolness to the atmosphere. But that's what it's like in Kingston. We are in West Kingston, downtown Kingston here, and uh, seems to be some issue with the net as the assistant checks and so Mount Pleasant in their customer 433 Liston James is in the starting lineup from last week last week for the last three games it would have been Latroy Leng Leng now on the bench 
and Listen James brought back into the, into the starting team as the right fullback uh, ranking, uh, playing as a defensive midfielder here. Uh, in football numbering system, you would be the number six, whilst Rodney is number eight here, and Nelson the new man seems to be playing in the number 10 spot as Reed now plays this one over to his captain. And Flemings are here is McCullough now inside the ranking. First piece of action for Mount Pleasant comes across. Running kick Anderson plays it forward. Fleming kicks, misses, comes now to Rodney. Rodney back to McCullough. McCullough as ball now played inside Trayvon Reed. Seem to be crying about some touch there as Rodney now can chip it inside, but he plays it across inside to Nelson. Nelson now to Rankin. Rankin now good shoot but goes wide to Liston James. James now back inside with Rankin who heads it inside. Here comes Rodney. Here is Nelson! And the force is a save now from the goalkeeper. So Nelson off the left boot, let fly. And goalkeeper Davian Watkins was alert to the danger and produced the save there in the first minute of play to bring the first shot of the encounter here and showing some intent here is the Mount Pleasant team. So, first corner kick here as Watkins palmed that one away. Ball comes in, headed out by the captain. Comes now to the number 16 player. <laughs> to read now, read back to Flemings. Flemings trying to come inside. Goes down on that challenge there. And free kick there. Not seen number 16 on the match sheet as a starter, but his name is here as Malik Golson. So just need to confirm those changes as this one now is played over for the run of Ben Bow, plays it across, trying to get Beckford going. Cut out by the former Arnett Gardens man, Jabir Johnson. Now Nelson can't get the better there off. Here's Rankin now, Rankin. We'll chip this one high for the run of Kestan Hall. Hall pushes down the player in the in the motion and foul that card for the referee. Parchment. Easy foul there. The man Hall just trying to move the man out of the way. And so here is Watkins to get us on the way. Anderson chips it forward trying to get. Fleming going. And ball now played forward. Pushed in the back there is Beckford as heads go up for the ball. Now Fleming will play it inside. Gets to Jermaine Johnson. Johnson now plays the ball. Former Premier League player, English Premier League player Johnson, national player, a decorated player, and has come back to his hometown club. And supports by playing. Here's the ball comes in inside, but Beckford can't get there as the ball played across by Kesslan Hall. Now played across, head inside, and it's with Rankin. Knocks it inside, trying to get it to Nelson. Nelson can't get the better there of the number six man. Here is Reed now back inside. Here is Tiwali on the ball now. He's being pulled back by Ram, and now the foul is given. Pulled back by Rodney there. and Quick restart, but referee was not having it. And not getting the numbers here. We, we got some starting. We got some starting names on the list, but not all the players who are on the starting team seem to be in this Tivoli Gardens starting lineup. We have no number 18 on the card, but a number 18 is playing, so we will have to start those out. In short order, here is Anderson now, boots this one long upfield, comes as far as to the left channel of the Mount Pleasant defence. Here now is Makala inside to Benbow. Benbow tries to get it back to Makala. Benbow pushed to the turf now by Fleming. So, so just to get some of these Tivoli Gardens names right, Shavar Campbell is number eight. Number six is Horatio Morgan. Number 17 is Devroy Gray. Number three is 
Davian Garrison. We have no number 18, so we'll have to get that name for you. As now Campbell boots this one high. Ronnie Candice goes up for the head. Here is Beckford with a bicycle kick, but over the top. And uh, goal kick now, the verdict. As we have just about four minutes gone in the encounter. Tivoli Gardens, they are playing in what we call Tangerine. And they are playing against the Mount Pleasant team in blue. As the ball now is booted high by Watkins. Comes inside by Garrison, played forward now. Here comes Richie now, plays this one forward. Played out again by Anderson, knocked inside. Rankin now gets it outside to Makala. Makala now looks inside, back to Rankin. Rankin under some pressure, gets it come to Campbell. Campbell boots it. Small field here at Tivoli, not what they would be used to. Jackson has this one, he's knocked inside now on the outside, but he's offside. And uh, we'll have to get the name of this number 18 player. So. A good little combination played there from the Tivoli Gardens team. One touch passing and then played out. Played out to the back. So here is Davis now to take this one. Boots it high. Upfield comes as far as to Hall. Hall can't win that one off guard. So here's Benbow now on the ball. Knocks it inside to Nelson. Nelson comes across to Makala. Makala to Benbow. Benbow under pressure from Flemings. Two players now giving attention, but he gets inside. Now he comes to Nelson. Nelson now trips it off to Rodney, but he's dispossessed by Ronnie K. Anderson. Campbell now will play that one upfield. And uh, that's a throw into Tivoli Gardens. So five minutes gone. Nil nil the scoreline here. Mount Pleasant, 41 points, second place. Playing against Tivoli Gardens, 33 points, seventh place. And Rodney pulled to the ground there by the Tivoli player. As we, that man is Morgan, the right fullback. As here is now kick to be taken by Sule Makala, boots it wide. Trying to get Hall. Now he makes contact, comes as far as to Liston James. Back inside with Rankin. Rankin trying to scoop it over to Rodney, but this wasn't successful. Now it comes to Jermaine Johnson, who plays it forward for the run after the man. Looks to be Garrison and running out of real estate there. And showing again. So both teams still trying to settle into a rhythm here. Uh, Mount Pleasant going long from the back seems to be the strategy. And then trying to make combination plays in attack. Tivoli trying to build from the back. Raniki Anderson he has been clearing everything that has come his way as Nelson now boots this one right side and Makala couldn't make contact with that. Maybe wanted to go more diagonally but good good idea here from, from the man Nelson. Here is Fleming now plays inside headed out by Campbell. And, and uh, show a judge to have come off the Tivoli Gardens player, and as such, the play goes to Tivoli now. Here comes now the man Kadim Davis, who calls for the ball, and Campbell obeys as this one goes forward now to Kemar Beckford. He's being hounded all the time as Hall and the referee. Doesn't want to make that call as it comes to Benbow. Play the advantage here is Rodney now pushes inside box, strips it across, and the call couldn't get there. Just missed at the back post. Good enterprising play there by Rodney, but couldn't couldn't make the final connection there to get it in the back of the net. Just one touch it needed, but couldn't get it there. So after nine minutes, still nil nil. Mount Pleasant with two sniffs at goal, and Richie now. Going over on the right hand side to bring company to Tivoli player as Campbell now controls. Rolls it inside to Jeremy Nelson. Nelson now across to Rodney. And Rodney can't make the sprint there. Here comes ball inside now. McCalla here running now does well to keep it in play. Ball off the hand of Fleming. As here comes 
McCullough now to take this free kick. So ball chip now in the side channel. Kemar Beckford took it on the chest but couldn't get the better of Jabir Johnson who can see a throw for Tivoli Gardens now inside with Benbow back to Makala. Makala controls, looks now, chips it for the run of Benbow. Benbow now being hounded all the time there by the Tivoli Gardens player and just concedes a throw in there. Campbell inside now to the man ranking inside to Nelson. Nelson trying to get it on the outside to Ben Bow. Now here is ball inside with Reed. Reed now twist turn. Young start chips it forward. Now good pass there inside. But he's forced wide all the time by, by Richie. Richie's there with him. Now it's headed out by Rankin. Comes as far as to the man Nelson. Can't control, dispossess. And now Mount Pleasant clear their lines through McCullough. Hes Hall can't get there before the defender. And now it's with Rankin. Rankin controls. Still Rankin. Now boots this one. Just across to Ben Bow, trying to get it to Rodney. Cut out. Here is Andy Silva. Tivoli Gardens come back inside. So Tivoli now on the ball with the man looks to be Campbell. Now it's played out by Watkins, the goalkeeper. And now some blood there. So clash of heads there. Some bleeding seen on the on the pitch. So. Medical staff immediately there. <laughs> as Rankin in his first taste of action getting a cut over the right eye so medical staff working feverishly to first stop the bleeding and then to get the player bandaged and to, to ensure that no further bleeding takes place. Normally uh, for an injury you'd have to come off the field but the referee allows for this to be done on the pitch because of the severity of the, the illness. Number 18 is actually Stephen Barnett just confirming who the 18 was as ranking now has been bandaged and should be making his way off. Not sure his condition if he will be fit to return. He's ready to go again. Here comes Johnson now, boots this one. Hi, Barnett. Played out now by Rodney headed out, foul again. Man, Keston Hall fouling the man Cam Campbell, Shavar Campbell. So, about three fouls for Hall as an attacker as Rankin makes his way back onto the field. So, 15 minutes here on the clock. It has been sprinted with some stoppage time as Johnson now chips this one forward into the lap of Jeremy Johnson. Wants to line up a shot. 
but wasn't allowed to turn there by the Mount Pleasant team as Nelson now trying to just beat that one high and Reed now being backed up by the one McCullough but Reed now does well to win the ball can he get it across cuts the man there and he's fouled fouled on the line he's shaped to square and cut him as they would say in Jamaican parlance and a good piece of skill there and Nelson had to foul but a good piece of skill there from the man Trayvon Reed. So 16 minutes gone here. Free kick, Fleming across the take. Here comes Fleming. Chips this one across and flags flag is up. Referee now spotting his assistant and it's Liston James seem to have a niggle but nothing happening here right now. Davis now comes off the foot of the captain Jabir Johnson will keep it in play plays it across to Watkins Watkins boots it forward ranking now trying to pay attention to Johnson here is Fleming now Outside, Tival in possession. Ball comes inside, but Campbell now will control. Here's Campbell. Now he boots it high upfield. Here is Jabir Johnson out. Ben Ball leaving that. Here comes Rodney and Fleming now boots that one outside for a throw in. 18 minutes gone in the piece here. As nil nil the scoreline. Ball inside now with Benbow. Benbow chips it inside to Nelson. Nelson dispossess here is Tivoli Gardens now and the attack chips it across for the run of Garrison. Garrison on the outside chips it forward looking for Barnett. Barnett controls now, still Barnett. But back inside comes to Garrison. Cut inside and foul there by Rankin. And free kick. Just inside the. Here is Fleming back inside with number 27 player. Everything has been running through him. Garnett, now it's with Johnson. Play don't know by Campbell. And Anderson comes, he misses, but shouldn't be no problem there for goalkeeper Watkins. As this one now comes inside, it's with number six player. Here is Morgan. Morgan plays it on the outside to Johnson, who chips it across. and. Played out by Ladi Richie. Here comes Benbo now. Chips it inside to Ronaldo Rodney. Rodney comes to Nelson. Nelson across to James. And James now plays it along the ground, trying to get Beckford. Can't get the ball to him there as Johnson now will take over. Comes back to Anderson, who just boots everything at one. Everything that he gets, he boots it away as it comes to Makala now. Comes across. Headed out by Fleming. Fleming again. And. Nelson. Beat fall. So, here comes. So, free kick. Midway the Tivoli half. Mount Pleasant to take his one. Play across to Nelson. Nelson controls, trying to turn. Still being hounded by Garnet. Nelson now chips it inside. Gets it to Rodney. Rodney trying to get Sule McCullough going on the outside. Comes off the check and now calls for handball. And uh, man, Rodney saying that one was coming off the chest. So, nil nil the score line. You're just joining us. It's Mount Pleasant. Blue. The visitors playing against Tivoli Gardens in uh, they say the colour is tangerine the horse as Richie now boots this one forward Fleming now 
plays this one across. Hall can't get there before Campbell. Garrison backs to Johnson. Johnson chips it inside. Listen, Jane misses out Campbell now. And that one goes out for a throw. So the, the size of the field still not being properly assessed by both. Well, especially Mount Pleasant uh, team. So ball not being... Lots of ball playing outside. Need better weight on the pass as ball come inside now with Campbell. Campbell talk to Rankin. Rankin now trying to boot this one forward. Comes to Beckford. Beckford takes it. Control still Beckford. Pushed off the ball here by Anderson. Who comes through the legs. And Beckford goes down under a challenge here. As and Anderson, he has a reputation of being a, a rough customer. No nonsense, hard tackling and carrying a lot of weight. So can't move very quickly. And uh, you won't get by him if he has the opportunity to, to take you out. So it's 22 minutes gone here. And back for the man. Seems to be fine. Sometimes these players embellish in order to get something more out of the officials. So Campbell now to take as chips this one forward towards Nelson. Anderson leaves for Watkins and no one in particular. Here this one now. Played high, comes as far as to Stephen Barnett, who did well to come across, but couldn't keep it in play. And it's a show for Mount Pleasant. McCullough now inside to Beckford. Beckford takes it well, plays it now for the run of Benbow, who's been hounded all the time by Fleming, but now it's cut out by Tivoli Gardens. Come now inside with Reed. Reed now chips it on the outside, gets it to Morgan. Morgan now for Tivoli Gardens, back to Reed. Reed now chips it back to Morgan. Can he keep it in play? No. And uh, once again, good attempt at combination play here as here comes McAllen now, throws it forward, but Fleming does well to come inside. Barnett inside to Reed. Reed back now to Johnson. Good turn there, but good interception by Richie. Timely interception. Back to Jabir Johnson now, back in the midfield. Comes to Rankin. Rankin now comes to Rodney. Rodney now pushed off the ball. And Rodney has this skill of getting himself between the ball and the man. So normally will draw, draw the foul as Rankin now. Will take this one for Mount Pleasant. So nil all the score line, 24 minutes gone. Ball chipped across, trying to get the run of all. And now it's a corner kick to the Mount Pleasant team. It's their second corner of the game. Tivoli, not yet with a corner. They had a free kick close to the corner flag. And four players now lining up inside the box, two on the outside. And two players at the half line, Lifts and James now not bothering to go as Tivoli has left two players behind. So Benbow now to take this corner kick. 24 minutes gone. Here the ball comes across low. Can't beat the front post man. Comes as far as to ranking. Comes to Beckford. Chips it across. Still Beckford. Now Rodney! And wide off the upright there. Just from the right hand side of the goal. Good technique to keep it down, but just wide of the upright as Tivoli start the proceedings early. Chips it forward now, comes to James. James heads it inside. Nelson now comes across, finds Rodney. Rodney trying to, and booted upfield now by Anderson for the run off Barnett. Barnett now being hounded by Campbell, but, but slipped there by Campbell here. Barnett now chips it across, but Richie now with the tackle there. And Rankin now will, will settle things as he now plays it across to all all chips it inside to Rodney Rodney with the wrong turn really just turned into the player there and gave away the football there so here and now he goes down really made the wrong decision to turn and he goes on and actually
So, 26 minutes here gone in the piece. It's still nil nil the score. You are at the Edwards Siaga Sports Complex. It's Tivoli Gardens. They are in seventh place, 33 points. They are playing against Mount Pleasant, who are in second place and 41 points. A win here for Tivoli. If no changes with the other teams above them, a win here for Tivoli would see them getting into the fifth spot and 36 points. As Arnett Gardens and Don't Be Old, and they have 35 points. Here comes ball knocked across inside now with Jabir Johnson coming inside to Garnet. Garnet now plays this one central but headed out by the man ranking. Comes across Benbow pushing in the back all the time but comes across to Johnson. Johnson now gets it to Campbell. Campbell now gets to Stephen Barnett. Barnett now trying to get on the outside but Ladale Richie had to tackle there and corner. So it's the first corner here for Tivoli Gardens after 27 minutes. As I told you before, Tivoli unbeaten in the last five games. Mount Pleasant without a win in the last four games. Here's Reed now who chips this one low but headed out by Campbell. Benbow now can look for the counter. Pushes it past Jabir Johnson who goes down well still and now he pulls him down and that's a professional foul. He had to get the foul there because he knew that if he did not foul him there he would have gone away and left him. So the first yellow card of the piece goes to the man Jabir Johnson. He was out of position. Benbow was lining up the counter attack. He went to ground. Benbow did not get away and he ensured that he didn't get away the second time. He just held on to him there and uh, is the first man to get into the referee's book here after 27 minutes. So here's a ball now. Comes across to James. James on the outside to Nelson but Nelson falling asleep there and now he managed to win back the ball but that's one always going wide there Ben Bo so goal kick the run So, ball played high. Just a small break in transmission there, just starting out a technical difficulty as now it comes to Morgan. Outside to Reed, Reed chips it inside. Barnett did well to chip this one inside to Reed, but McCalla now. Now he turns and boots it off Reed and gets the goal kick there. So, we apologize for that short break. As so. Here comes goal kick. Half an hour gone here in the piece. As booted wide and Hall. Here comes Fleming now inside to Reed. Reed back to Fleming. Fleming trying to get the run of Morgan. Morgan now. Makala now not alert to the danger. And still Morgan going on the right hand side. Morgan now he runs outside. And it's a goal kick. So 
just miscommunication here. As it boots forward now, comes to Benbo. Benbo can't control, but passes to Nelson. Nelson back to the man Rodney. Here comes now the man ranking and just over dribble there and not having the requisite pace to get back as it comes across now for the man Jermaine Johnson trying to go between two players and he was boxed out there as he comes now to Rankin, Rankin with a short pass to Nelson. Now come back to Rankin, Rankin now boots it on the outside. So here comes now the man list and James chips it across to Beckford to inside and off the line there and what he has been And as he did, when he came here the last time, he has done it again. Cordell Benbo, after 32 minutes, arriving at the back post to give the visitors Mount Pleasant a one nil lead. Beckford was the man who started the attack, but the man, Cordell Benbo, got on the end of it to make it 1-0 in favor of Mount Pleasant after 32 minutes here in this encounter. So here comes Flemings. Foul there. Booted long up field. Campbell comes across, heads out. So, 1 0 the scoreline here. As comes across now. Morgan now dispossessed by Rodney. Here is Hall. Hall, the man dribbling out now, still dribb plays it inside to Nelson. Nelson being hounded by Garnet. Now, Nelson chips this one now for the run of Benbo. Is he offside? Yes, he is. And the referee just waited to see if contact would be made as Johnson now plays this for the run of Garrison. Garrison now on the outside. Former Uwe player back to Jabir Johnson. Johnson across to goalkeeper Watkins. Doesn't have a pass. Short, so may have to go long. No pressure on the ball, so it comes back to Jabir Johnson. Here is Johnson now. Plays this one across. To the man Campbell. Campbell trying to get it to Garrison. Cut out by the goal scorer Benbow. Now it's with Nelson. Nelson now across but gives the ball away to Morgan. Morgan cuts back inside. Garnet now comes across to Campbell. Campbell now to Reed. Reed for Tivoli Gardens. Reed comes through the middle of the pitch. Comes across now to Morgan. Looking for the captain but comes to Raniki Anderson. Anderson now. Comes dribble over into the still Anderson, still Anderson pushing down. Now he chips it inside for the run of Barnett, but cut, so, cut out there by Campbell. But no pressure on the Tivoli defense as Mount Pleasant seemed to have started to defend already. And it's just 34 minutes gone in the half as, and now it's chipped across and it's a free kick. So. So here is Kadim Davis. Boots this one upfield inside as comes across, headed out by Nelson. Comes now to ranking. Here comes James inside to Rodney. Rodney, yeah. poor pass there, too short, and could have been dangerous. Here comes now, ball back to the man, Ladiel Richie chips it forward, trying to get Beckford going. Rodney now wins the ball, can't beat Garnet there with the pass as it comes now across to Barnett, but it comes back inside. Here comes Anderson, and the referee spots an infringement there, just saying that he moved his body. And cause the player to go down. Garnet now comes across to Fleming. Fleming now chips inside to Johnson. Johnson being hounded by McCullough. McCullough leaves him now for Rodney. Now it comes across for Morgan who can't keep it in play. Yes, he does. And now the referee signals 
that it's a showing as we are right beside the Mount Pleasant bench here and 36 minutes gone and 1-0 one the scoreline here one in favour of the visitors Mount Pleasant Cardell Benbow the man getting the goal in the 32nd minute here is Benbow now pushes his one upfield can James get there no not before Jabir Johnson who wins a throw for his team 36 minutes here Edward Siaga Sports Complex it's 1-0 the score Tivoli Gardens they are trailing by a goal to nil as the visitors Mount Pleasant have taken the lead through Cardell Benbow in the 32nd minute we have 36 minutes gone in the piece here but Lots of time for injury, particularly one to Rankin where the medical staff had to patch him up. So we expect some stoppage time as McCullough now comes in, takes but Reed now will settle things. Knocks it across to Garnet. Garnet now back to Reed. Reed knocks it inside to Jeremy and Johnson. Johnson now back to Reed. Reed couldn't get a good touch. And it's a 50-50 ball, but, but Fleming does well. The, the, the braver player there. And he's fouled by Kessan Hall. And here comes. So, free kick. So here is. So. Jabir Johnson now chips this one forward and goalkeeper Davis no problems there as he boots this one now for the run of Beckford Beckford now balls beat Jabir Johnson goalkeeper coming but Beckford and looks to be oh Watkins it was almost a own goal there Jabir Johnson with the header Watkins had to stretch for his life to tip it outside the upright and Tivoli live to fight another day here as that counter attack, it was the goalkeeper Davis booted it long upfield. Jabir Johnson got there before Beckford got the header. He thought that Watkins was there. Watkins was somewhere else and had to stretch to keep Tivoli only down by one goal as we await this corner kick. From Cardell Benbow, here is the kick. 38 minutes gone. Chipped to the back post. Nelson goes up but headed out there by the man. Barnett here comes Beckford now chips it. Boots it hard along the ground. Now he will cross it again and Tivoli still resolute in defence to concede their fourth corner of the game here. As exciting stuff but still one nil in favour of Mount Pleasant here after 39 minutes in the piece. Other games being played today but the attention is right here at the Edwards. It comes across now. It comes as far as to Beckford. Beckford down the line still. Oh, and he just over dribbled there. And Beckford is chasing one Dean Andre Thomas from Don Beholding. Beckford has scored 11 goals. He is second place on the goal scoring chart behind the man Dean Andre Thomas on 12 from Don Beholding. As here comes. Mr. Benbow pushed off the ball there by Campbell. Nothing there, said referee. Campbell now motoring down the left-hand side for Tivoli Gardens. Chips it inside. Comes to Johnson. Ball one there by Rankin. Johnson will stay on the ground as the ball comes now to Liston James. James chips it over inside to Jabir Johnson. Will cut it out. And Johnson was waiting for the referee's whistle there but it wasn't coming referee Danian Parchment FIFA referee man out of Trilani as this one now played across the pitch comes to Sule Makala Makala controls look up the field and sees Keston Hall Hall dispossessed by Fleming and fouled in the process and now he's going to take a yellow card it was the second time so the referee is saying one two three no more and that's the fifth foul that's the fifth foul there for Kesson Hall and has worked his way into the referee's book as referee parchment now here is Fleming now plays this one now across comes down to Morgan Morgan now cuts inside has Fleming on the outside if he wants to cross and corner kick there corner kick there so Coaching staff was Cifero here on the bench. 
trying to make sure that they preserve this one nil lead. And Mount Pleasant has not kept a clean sheet in the last four games and would be intent on doing that now as a corner kick to be taken by a number eight player, Mr. Campbell. Chips this one across, headed out by Rankin, comes as far as to the man Rodney and goes out for a throw. So 41 minutes gone, according to our watch. Stoppage is also to be considered as Johnson now, who occupies the, the left fullback role, knocks it inside to Campbell. Now Campbell could get across, but he plays it down the line. Looks to be the man Garrison out there, comes to Trevor and read, read back to Campbell. Campbell now chips it across, ranking, heads that out. Here comes the man Hall now, dribbling. Here's Hall, boots it now for the run of Beckford, but too much purchase on the pass. And no problem for Watkins. Here comes Campbell now. Here comes to Reed. Reed did well just to come there and get in his pace. Here comes Fleming now. Controls well. Can he get across inside? Chips it across. Try to get it to the man Barnett. Headed out now by Campbell. Comes as far as to Rodney. 50 50 ball. Garnett is the winner. Comes now to Kestanal who chips it forward. Trying to get it to Beckford. Beckford now just stopped in his tracks there by Raniki Ambison. They are calling him the bulldozer here. And he plays this one crossway now to the man Liston Hall. Hall now chips it forward. Liston James rather chips it forward. For a moment there we gave Liston the wrong surname. But that's actually Liston James over on the right hand side for Mount Pleasant. So 42 minutes played. Ball comes across. It's with Jabir Johnson. Johnson now. Here comes inside to Camp Morgan. Back to Johnson. And out of play there. So, here comes plays forward now, comes across Ronnie Candice now can't and Watkins will take over there. 43 minutes taken, here comes ball now. Richie can't get the better of Barnett. Barnett now plays it in cross to Reed. Reed, Reed now still Reed on the ball, looks, turns, Reed now inside to Barnett. Barnett fall there by Richie and free kick now to the Mount Pleasant to the Tivoli team deep inside the Mount Pleasant half so just so 28 minutes so the fans enjoying themselves here. You might have heard some language with some colors. Just the fans. As you, here. So here is. Here's chips across now. Kadim Davis comes, misses. Nobody there. As this now plays it forward and ranking again. Same spot. So. So now here, the ball inside now with the man Barnett. Barnett plays it across to Campbell. Campbell now to go down the right hand side and he's dispossessed there by Keston Hall. One nil the scoreline here in favour of Mount Pleasant as it comes across to the man Garrison who is pushed off the ball by Nelson but now he wins back the ball. Garrison can he get this ball across? Garrison still going there. Here comes to Trevon Reed. Wants to line up a shot but can't get the shot there. Cut out by Richie. Now Ben Boat pokes the ball away. Here is Reed now being challenged by Rodney. Comes to Garnett now. Garnett across to Campbell. Campbell now to chip inside. Campbell with the cross inside. The heads go up! But no one in particular. Sule McCullough is there. 
and uh, goal kick, goal kick here. Yes. Ranking again after. So now free kick here to be taken by the man Kadim Davis. So, Davis now boots it high over on the far side now for Beckford now to chase. Can he keep it in play? No, and it's throwing now there the verdict as 47 minutes gone unofficially here in the piece as ball now played headed out by McCullough. Comes as far as Nelson Nelson can't get it by Garnett. Here comes Johnson takes on the chest played out by Liston James. Here comes Rankin can't get there before. Johnson here is Johnson now plays it on the outside to the man Garrison. Garrison now chips it forward back to Teddy Johnson who has drifted over on the left hand side. Here is Johnson now. Can he get it inside? Comes to Trayvon Reed. Reed now lines up a shot. But now it's blocked there by the man Nelson. Now Liston James go down, goes down on a challenge but... Man couldn't get there, Johnson. So we have already passed 45 minutes. As I told you before, lots of injury time based on the injury incurred by the man. This is the Mount Pleasant channel. As we greet you with the halftime score, it's Mount Pleasant 1 and Tivoli Gardens nil. Goal coming in the 32nd minute from the boot of Cardell Benbo. So 1-0 the scoreline here after halftime. Mount Pleasant lead at Tivoli Gardens by a goal to nil. Edward Siaga Sports Complex here, Tivoli Gardens, the home team, versus Mount Pleasant of St. Anne. And uh, halftime news is that Mount Pleasant lead by a goal to nil. Goal scored in the 32nd minute by Cardell Benbow. One substitution for Mount Pleasant, the debutant Rankin, he was substituted for Alwyn Harvey. And uh, number 18, ah. Kevin Graham, is being lined up to come on. Maybe for number six, not so sure, but let's see how that goes. As this one comes across to Campbell, and uh, Nelson now plays this one out. Comes as far as to Benbow. Benbow now trying to get ahead of the player. Here is Beckford now on the right hand side. Still Beckford. Still Beckford now. Still Beckford comes inside, plays it outside to the man Nelson. Nelson now boots this across, trying to get it to Hall, but forces him backwards. As the wall comes inside now to Alwyn Harvey. Harvey now and just first taste of action. Just boots this one. As so Harvey seemed to have been flashing. So so coming off, it looks to be the captain, Ladiel Richie. So two force changes here. Two force changes here as Kevin Graham now coming in. And uh, ball comes inside now to here comes ball over on the right hand side and Graham pulled to the turf there by Stephen Barnett.
Here's a ball <laughs> booted long upfield. Comes inside to the man chips across trying to get all going but couldn't get him going there. As Graham, the former Tivoli Gardens man, is playing here now for Tivoli Gardens as Campbell now boots that one out for a throwing. As ball played inside with Garrison, comes back to Johnson. Johnson wants to get it across, chips it inside, comes off the head there of Morgan. And uh, nothing there. Here is so two substitutions made, two forced substitutions. Ball comes now, played across. It's go up here's Beckford now under some pressure from Jabir Johnson. Johnson boots it, played back up by Liston and James. James now over to Ranike Anis who misses the header. But some timid play there from the man Ben Bow. And uh, uh, Anderson's re reputation precedes him, so players not taking a chance as Zambi now goes down the right hand side, cuts inside, sees Zambi coming inside, chips it straight into the arms of the goalkeeper. After a good run there inside the box, ball comes now and comes off the chest of Campbell. Here is the man, Nelson. Harvey now does well to show good strength. Now he does well to try to get the ball to Ben Bow, but not to anybody in particular. Harvey again with a slight interception comes now to the man, Garnet. Garnet across to Campbell. Campbell now back to Garnet. Here's Garnet on the ball, still Garnet. Garnet now, still with the ball, still Garnet. Chips this one now over to the far, headed out there by Graham. Now to Harvey, to Nelson, back to Harvey. Harvey now going up the right hand side, still Harvey now. And Rodney now will chip a ball for Beckford to come on the outside, but cut out there by Campbell. It's Ben Bono, chips it across for Hall to put it in the back of the net, but he misses. He misses from 12 yards. That should have been 2 nil, But he played it wide. And Watkins play this one again. Here comes Nelson. Heads this one forward. Rodney now. Benbo trying to get by Campbell. And Campbell plays it out for a throw into Mount Pleasant. Here is Liston James now coming to, to throw. As here comes Harvey now. So long throw, it looks to be the verdict. Plays inside, headed out by Garnet, come back to James, James to Rodney. Rodney now wants to go down the line, but now it's a throw again to Mount Pleasant. 54 minutes gone here. And it's inside now to Rodney and James. And Garrison now. And he shows the yellow card to the man Garrison for the catch there. And referee parchment not having any of it. And showing there. So, here's Campbell now to cross. Campbell now, but that one outside of the box and poor there from Campbell. As one nil the score here, Mount Pleasant lead after 55 minutes in this encounter. Goal scored in the 32nd minute by the man Cardell Benbow. Mount Pleasant there in blue and uh, Tivoli Gardens in tangerine. That's the color we got. So here is. So here comes.
ball now inside. And tackled up there by Mount Pleasant. Here's Ben Bono chips it forward, trying to get the run. Here comes off the, off the back there of Morgan, headed out by Graham. Comes as far as to Morgan. Morgan now trying to get it to Johnson. Johnson comes to Garrison. Now Trevon Reed. Reed back across to Johnson. Here it comes now to Garnett. Garnett plays it across to Javier Johnson. Javier Johnson now plays across inside of the hand there of Morgan. And uh, no problems there. As here comes. So, 56 minutes gone here. 1 0 score in favor of Mount Pleasant. Ben Bow with his sixth goal of the season as this one chips now forward. Comes to Anderson, who authoritative header. Here comes Harvey, heads it back. Here comes Harvey again, heads it again, Harvey. Here comes now, the man Beckford cut out now by Mount Pleasant. Here comes Tivoli now, Tivoli with the ball. Plays it across to Garrison, but can't get it past James. James chips it now inside for the run of Beckford, but Jabir Johnson now will get that away. Here comes as far as to Alwyn Harvey now, and Rodney can't turn, but Hall will take over, loses out now to Tivoli Gardens. Here comes across to Campbell. Campbell now, here comes Fletcher now on the outside. Flemings rather, and tackled up now by Makala. Makala who is now wearing the captain arms and playing it across to Rodney. Rodney now inside and goes down under a challenge. And um, Makala down. So. So, 57 minutes down here. Free kick to Mount Pleasant. Just close to the halfway line inside the Mount Pleasant half. They are leading by a goal to nil. And it's... Campbell now to take this free kick here. Yes. Ball played now towards the back line, headed out. Controlled by Garrison. Garrison back to Campbell. And free kick on. A yellow card to Liston James. Just tackling through the player there. And, uh, not much happening in the second half uh, outside of that chance. Glorious opportunity missed by Mr. Hall. And he comes across now to Fleming. Fleming now plays it across inside the midfield. Comes inside to Johnson. Johnson goes over to Morgan. Morgan to Reed. Reed now can cross. Chips it inside. Headed out by Graham. Comes as far as to. Rodney who didn't control well first touch was poor. Yes, Reed now chips it inside. But played out by Suley McCullough now for Beckford to chase. Raniki Anderson now comes across to Jabir Johnson. And now he goes back to goalkeeper Watkins. And here comes Watkins now to boot long upfield. Heads go up as Campbell now pushed off the ball by Teddy Johnson there. And McCullough again is going down to the turf. And So, so here is as it comes across. So here comes ball inside to Ben Bono. Chips it one, but headed out there by Raniki Anderson. Ben Bono goes up. Here comes Garnett. And uh, here, is, here comes the ball with Barnett. Here comes Harvey now. Chips it across to Liston James. James. So, throwing now as Ben Bono comes pushed off the ball there by Garrison. 
So, 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 so here comes free kick now by Jeremy Nelson. Chips this one across inside and played out by Fleming there. Corner kick, Mount Pleasant. Here comes Ben Bono with the corner kick, goes to the back post, comes as far as to Beckford. Beckford now goes down the line, still Beckford twisting and turning. And Garnet is there, pushing the face, foul there, hand in the face there. And So, free kick to Mount Pleasant. 62 minutes gone here. 1 0 they lead. Uh, it's goal scored in the 32nd minute by Cardell Benbo. And Mount Pleasant now with a free kick trying to double their lead here over the host. Tivoli Gardens have been scoring some late goals. As Nelson. Ball now comes across. Here is Nelson. Chips it over now. Nelson comes across. Here is headed towards goal by Graham. And ball played high. Reed can't control. Harvey now loses out there to Reed as the man. Garza comes cr across and he comes back with the recovery tackle there. Here is Campbell now. Campbell now chips it inside and played it, play it out there. And the goalkeeper couldn't keep it in play. And good defensive recovery by Harvey there. Here comes Campbell running across to take the free kick there. So... Substitution here. Looks to be the man. Jermaine Johnson is coming off. Big And coming on. Biggest thing in the league. And the fans are saying he's the Junior biggest thing in, in the league. Junior McGregor. Junior number Junior seven. Junior coming on. And Bill Fleming. And number ten. ten, ten uh, Teddy Johnson. Jermaine Johnson is coming off. And now the number 16, we, he was on the start list, will be coming on. But Junior McGregor is on for the man as he's headed out now by Keston Hall. Here is Campbell again. And ball off the arm of, of Keston Hall. They call him Zombie. So Clinton Ashley now to come on. And uh, not sure. And uh, the man Morgan is coming off. So Morgan and Johnson off, and Ashley and McGregor on. So here comes McGregor now, who is a dead ball specialist, Junior McGregor. And he's his first piece of action here, as he will take it now. So his ball chipped across inside. Headed out there by Graham. Now comes to Ashley, the next substitute, but he can't get anything there. Here comes Beckford now. Beckford now being, going on a challenge by Fleming. Lose it out to Ashley. Ashley in the back of Nelson. And some mix up there, but here's Fleming. And Jabir Johnson gets it out there. 65 minutes gone here as comes across to Graham. Graham beats it long upfield. Cut out there by Reed. Reed now 
knocks it inside, gets it to Garrison. Garrison goes across to the man. Ashley just coming on. Can he keep it in play? Yes, he does. Ashley now over on the line. Still, Ashley looks to be fleet footed. Yes, Ashley chips it across. Nobody in particular here is Benbo now. Benbo now back to Jeremy Nelson. Jeremy Nelson now boots it for the run of Beckford, but not a accurate pass here. Here is Fleming now. Fleming inside to Garrison. Garrison back on the right hand side to Ashley. So Ashley now seeing a lot of the action. Chips it over now. Comes across to Reed. But Reed will have to chase now. Can he keep it in play? Yes, he does. And now tackled up there by Liston James. So Tivoli now, with the, with the substitutes, have been asserting themselves in the game as we have the man Barnett now, knocks it across to Jabir Johnson. Jabir wants to cross, gets it inside, Sule Makala is there, heads out now, comes to Harvey, Harvey now, boots it, outfield here, it comes now to Beckford, who will have to chase his own ball as Raniki Anderson out to clear, and he boots it long upfield here, it comes to Rodney, Rodney now who is tackled up there, and he comes as far as to the man Fleming, Fleming now to cross, Fleming cross inside, headed out by Campbell. Is it a corner kick? No. Sule Makala heads again. And Campbell and uh, Garrison, last man to play. Referee says no. Referee says no. And it's a corner kick. To Mount Pleasant here. And so, six to seven minutes here, gone. Here comes inside now, chips across to McGregor. McGregor chips it inside. It's going up and miss as Distant James now. we play this one out for a throw in. So here comes a sustained period of pressure here from Tivoli Gardens. Can they get a goal to show for it? Comes back inside. Now on the outside, chipped inside by Campbell. Comes to the man Garrison. Here comes Barnett now. Barnett plays it up the line to Javier Johnson to cross inside, but cleared out by Campbell. Comes as far as to his opposite number, Campbell. And ball now played in to Campbell. Campbell inside to Garrison. Garrison back to Campbell. Campbell. No, can't get it by Benbo. Benbo holds up the ball. Here comes Nelson now. Chips it forward for the one Beckford to run. Beckford under pressure now by two players. Still Beckford. Still Beckford. Now he chips it across for the run of the man Rodney. Rodney comes to Benbo. Benbo trying to play it on the right hand side to get it to Hall. But this possessed by Tivoli who have regrouped. Now here comes the ball and free kick here. And a player is down. Campbell and referee now will call a Hall to proceedings. To see what's going on. So, 68 minutes gone, one nil Mount Pleasant lead. Benbo in the 32nd minute, it's sixth goal of the season, and that's the story here so far. Three yellow cards apiece per team, and uh, two substitutions each. And uh, Here is ball now played. Headed out by there, control now by Ben Bo who hurriedly played the ball there. Comes to back to Campbell. As now it's this was a series. Nelson now plays it along the line and offside. He came from the offside position. So here comes and throwing the verdict. So here comes now showing James come inside to McGregor, McGregor to Garnet, Garnet now dispossessed by Rodney, Rodney across to the man Sule Makala, Makala now looks for a pass, chips it forward for the run of Beckford, cut out by Ranik Anderson and Hard Harvey cuts it out, here is Nelson, fouled by one, fouled by two and now he doesn't get the call, here comes Ranik Anderson now plays this one forward, here is Kevin Graham to chase, can he shield this one, now he chips it and gives them a throw in and here comes
So some problem, so problems here on the bench, and so here come. So yellow card shown to looks to be Admiral Bailey. Well, the new the, the rule is that once there is a problem with a member of the coaching staff, the card will go to the coach. So uh, whether it's Admiral Bailey or the man Philip Williams, I'm not sure which one of them, but it looks to be and. Uh, it's an altercation here between the, 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 the match commissioner and Admiral Bailey, who is telling the, 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 the match commissioner to go and sit down. Uh, as now McGregor chips it inside, headed out by Campbell. Sun seems to be impairing his vision as it comes across now with Campbell. So in the meantime, the drama, the touchline, Tivoli, as now is chipped across, played out now by Graham. Comes now as far as to Beckford. Beckford now has three to beat. Still Beckford. Beckford knocks it across. Here comes Suley Makala now. It's a ball now to Kessanal. Kessanal with one to beat. Here comes Kessanal now. Can he beat him? Now he tries to run by him. Get inside the box. One he misses again. Good save though by goalkeeper Watkins. Did well. Walk past the goalkeeper by the defender. And Kessanal did all the hard work there. Couldn't get the ball in the back of the net. Here's the ball now chipped over. James comes across to the man Nelson. Nelson falls to the turf. Here comes Rodney and the referee will call back the action now. As so. Here comes McGregor now. McGregor chips it across. Gets it to Fleming over on the far side. Can Fleming get across in and Kessan all can see the corner there. And, uh, here comes McGregor, plays it across. Cleared out by McCullough. Comes as far as to Fleming. Fleming now wants to cross but being hounded there by Rodney. And a free kick. Free kick on the edge of the box there. And... Uh, And so, free kick. McGregor again to take. Lots of heads going up in the box here. As McGregor now ring this, ring now, to take this free kick edge of the box here this ring. as this ring. McGregor now to take here comes McGregor now chips it along the ground and inside the box and uh, Ashley and uh, Mount Pleasant survive Mount Pleasant survive and uh, it tricked everyone there. They thought he was going high. He came along the ground and came inside the box. But no Tivoli player with any good connection to trouble the score sheet. So it's 74 minutes here. One nil the score in favor of Mount Pleasant. Incidentally, the last time Mount Pleasant came to Tivoli Gardens, it was Cardell Benbow who got the goal. That subjected Tivoli to a one nil defeat. And he's the man again who is proving a menace to Tivoli. Here is now Fleming. Headed out by Nelson. Comes across to Ashley, the substitute. Plays it inside to Barnett. Barnett across to McGregor. Here is McGregor now. Back outside to Reed. Reed now wants to cross, but he's been hounded by McCullough. And Harvey now with the tackle there. And comes as far as to Hall. Can comes now. Looks to be Benbow, but Benbow being hounded by Anderson. Now the ball headed now. Comes as inside to. And he's offside. And. Uh, Somebody down on the turf here and looks to be Kadim Davis. And so So 
Here comes ball now inside with Barney. Still Barney on the ball. Chips it across to the back post but outside. And Here comes now a ball. Davis now boots this one forward, comes as far as to Hall. Hall with the flick on, comes as far as to the man Jabir Johnson. Johnson now comes to Campbell, Campbell across, played out now by James. And Oh, Barnett gets away, comes across to Garrison, but Garrison now can't get by. Benbow now comes inside to McGregor, McGregor not allowed to turn. Now he chips it over on the far side and gets Fleming going, Fleming controls. Can he get the cross? Fleming now chips it inside and Harvey now clears, headed further forward by Benbow, but as far as to Garrison, Garrison no, Garnet rather, Garnet. Rodney now dispossessed as Nelson now with the challenge chips it now across for the run of Rodney. It's 2v2 here as Rodney comes across. Beckford now making the run. Here is Beckford making the run. Here comes Rodney and now he comes across to the man. To the man. Less than James. Here comes Beckford now. Comes across back to James. James chips it forward now, trying to get Kesson all going. Campbell heads. Comes as far as Ashley Ash inside to Garnet. Garnet inside to McGregor. McGregor now being attended to by Harvey. Chip play back inside to Fleming. Fleming now trying to get the one to McGregor, but Beckford now comes inside. Still Beckford. Here comes Chips it inside. Comes to Reed. Reed chips it over. Gets it to Barnett. Can Barnett get a shot off? Chips it over to Garrison. Over on the far side. Chips it back to the back post. And now it comes as far as to Ashley. Ashley can keep it in play. Chips it back across. Headed out by Campbell. But it comes only as far as to Garrison. Garrison can cross again. Cuts inside the man. Here's Garrison with the left foot. But off the body of the man Rodney. Headed out again by Mount Pleasant. And now now it's a corner kick. So 79 minutes gone. 79 minutes gone. One nil the score. As Mount Pleasant. Ball comes across. Headed out. Here comes. The ball comes across now. 80 minutes gone in the encounter here as the ball is come. Still Tivoli on the ball. Now dispossessed by Mount Pleasant. It comes to Reed. Reed with the ball. 10 minutes to go in this encounter as this one comes across. Plays to Harvey who gets it to Reed. Reed back to McGregor. McGregor now comes across to the back post. Stephen Barnett trying to get the ball there but cut out by Sule Makala. Here is ball now played across to the man Garrison. Comes to Jabir Johnson. Here is Garnet now on the ball. Garnet plays it back. Cut out now by Ben Bow. Garnet still. Here is Fleming now plays this one high up into the field. McGregor controls. Here now Ashley comes as far as to Trevor and Reed. Reed now wants to put it across goal. Headed out by Campbell. Comes now to Liston James who boots this one high up the field. Here comes Beckford, but played again by Garnet. Liston James off the tie. Ball comes now inside to Barnet. Campbell across to Reed. Reed now on the left hand side, still Reed. Reed now cuts it inside to McGregor. McGregor across 
to the man Ashley. They're looking for the offside, but no, Ashley squares it inside to Barnett. Comes to Garrison. Garrison now and can't get the goal. Still a blue wall there. And Fleming now going forward. Here is Kessan all being hounded there all the time. Here is Tivoli now. Ashley now with the ball comes across and manages to kick it. So substitution now, Trevor and Reed is out. Coming in, it's Newton Sterling. Newton Sterling here, the man to come in. As Tivoli Gardens with a free rate of pressure here. He lined up here. As 80, 83 minutes gone here, as Tivoli Gardens with a period of pressure here. And so here comes substitution to be made, and coming off is number 11. <laughs> so So, yeah, what you need a OFC when you quote. Hello. So, ball comes inside. McCullough now boots it long up the field. Comes as far as to Beckford who takes it on the chest. Goes down under the challenge. Wins a four. So, As ball now with Garrison. Garrison now comes across to Fleming. Fleming further across to Campbell. Campbell looking for Ashley over on the left hand side. Ashley now on the left hand side comes across. He's faced up by Jeremy Nelson. Tackled up by Nelson there. Ashley again comes across to Garnet. Garnet now controls. Now he's dispossessed. Plays it forward now for the run of Benbow now. Benbow can go 1v1, but a bad control there by Benbow. Really should have done a little better there, but now he just watches Garnet play it out on the pitch. As so So here comes ball to be thrown in. Pushed off the ball there by Campbell. Referee says no. And here it comes now to Harvey. Harvey now can't get the air before Rodney. And the referee now points to the spot. So here is free kick. 86 minutes gone here in this encounter. McGregor now over on the left hand side for Tivoli. Wants to swing this one inside. Still, now he's dispossessed by the man Beckford who chips it now for the run of Benbow now. Goalkeeper to come. Benbow is a 50 50 race, but the goalkeeper Watkins get there, gets there before Benbow. Here comes the man Garnet now. Free with nothing to do. Now he plays it across to the man McGregor. McGregor now chips it inside. Heads go up, comes as far as to Kadim Davis, and Davis goes to ground. And here comes the man, Kadim Davis, the goalkeeper here, as he holds up proceedings here. 86 minutes gone in the piece, as now ball played by Nelson. Nelson now chips it for the run of Beckford. Beckford now trying to get between the two defenders as Fleming plays it to his goalkeeper, Watkins. Watkins now rolls it out, comes as far as to the man, Ashley, the substitute, comes down to Campbell. Campbell wins. Ah, Jeremy Nelson now wins the ball, plays it inside to Benbow, plays it back now for the run of Nelson, but two... 
too heavy the pass there as the ball played now inside. Here comes Campbell now, inside to Fleming. Here comes Len, comes across now to... Barnett, Barnett twisting and turning, gets a ball across, trying to get it to Fleming. But now it comes to the number 17, Rodney. Rodney now, Rodney now, still Rodney on the ball, still Rodney going down the line, still Rodney. And now he's dispossessed by Fleming and fouls the man there. And Rodney will go into the referee's book for a foul on the man, Fleming. So here is McGregor, chips this one, headed out by Graham, headed now by Alvin Harvey, Campbell now on the ball, Campbell and under pressure by Ben Bow, and it's a show into Mount Pleasant to Tivoli Gazi, Tivoli now with Ashley, Ashley being tackled up by Jeremy Nelson, still Ashley going up the flank and now the ball booted out by Liston James who boots that one out of the park as a show you now and uh, James giving a talking to by the referee here is 88 minutes now gone in the fixture here as Campbell now inside, McGregor did shimmy but played out now by Leng, here comes Beckford now, he's pressing the ball, still Beckford coming down the line, goalkeeper is there and boots this one long field, comes as far as to Campbell, Campbell can't get there before Benbow, Benbow does well to get the better of Campbell, being fouled all the time and So 89 minutes gone here. Nello, Nello, run off it, don't give that corner. Don't give money ball like corner, so no. Let that go. Keep, keep. keep. James to Nelson. Here comes to Graham. Graham forward. Boots ball long up field. Eighty-nine minutes gone here as the ball comes inside with Garrison. Garrison plays it across to Fleming. Fleming now on the outside. Still Fleming now wants to come inside. Comes to the man McGregor. McGregor now can look over on the right hand side and for Fleming, but chips it across the goal. Headed out by Liston James and offside there. The call as so 90 minutes we have here on our clock we know that we have some stoppage time so not sure how much time will be put up by the fourth official as Kadim Davis to take Ball now played. Long here comes Beckford. Takes it on the chest. Still Beckford. And ball. Benbow inside. Benbow inside. Bushes steer. Bushes steer. Bushes steer. Bushes steer. Bushes steer. Here comes the ball now by Fleming. Comes now to. And that one should run out. Javier Johnson is well, but I but always stretching for that one. That one will come out. So here is here comes Kadim Davis now play this one high up the field comes to Beckford headed out by Jabir Johnson Nelson can't make any connection on that but it comes as far as to Benbo Benbo no Benbo no come here Abu Afari Abu Afari Abu Afari Abu Afari so here comes 
So, spectators getting into it here as ball comes now to, to Ben Bono pushing off the ball there. A referee says no. As ben here comes the ball inside as Leng now puts some pressure on him here. Ball comes across inside with the man Fleming. Fleming now trying to push forward. Here comes Fleming now pushing through the middle of the field still. Comes across now to the man Garrison. Garrison now over on the far side wants to cross. Looking for Sterling who is the target. Ball come up, heads out and over the top there by Liston James. Corner kick there. So four minutes of stoppage time look to be going up on the clock. We already have 93 minutes on our clock as McGregor now chips this one across. The heads go up and headed outside there. And goalkeeper needs some attention as four minutes is signaled here. We have 93 minutes gone by our watch. So, so... So, four minutes, four minutes signal by the official. So, it's still one nil the score here. Dying moments of the piece. Tivoli desperately trying to get back onto the score sheet. Mount Pleasant defending for all their worth. And so far, I've done... Here is a goal kick to be taken by the goalkeeper, Davis. Overload, overload. Boots it long, upfield. Comes as far as to Benbow. Fleming said comes off the hand, but comes to Ashley now. Ashley to Nelson. Nelson now can't win the ball there. Free kick awarded to Tivoli. And here comes. Free kick now take it, to be taken by McGregor. So we are into stoppage time here. Just about three minutes of stoppage time left as McGregor now boots this one high. Comes off the player, Ben Bodier. Comes inside as far as to Campbell. Campbell now going wide, trying to get it to Jabir Johnson. Jabir Johnson now wants to turn to get the cross, but he's being hounded by the band. Uh, Rodney here comes a ball now chipped over by Campbell. Comes the head, go up and comes off the bar there. So McGregor with the header, but it comes off the crossbar. Tivoli again knocking on the door. Let's go up. Here comes Ranik Anderson now. Over on the far side. Can he get it back? But good tackle up there by Benbow. But now he loses it out to Anderson, who plays it across. Comes down to Nelson and boots it to no one in particular. Here comes the ball now with Watkins. Watkins who wants to go over on the far side. It's with Garrison. Garrison now does well to get by McCullough. Here comes Barnett. Barnett chips it inside. Played out by Alwyn Harvey. The man now, Rodney, is giving some attention to McGregor. McGregor on the ball. Still McGregor now chips it in with the left foot. Headed out inside. Here comes Ashley. Headed out again by Campbell. It's a blue wall. And the orange shots are coming in. Here comes Raniki Anderson. And booted out again by Campbell. And it's... Drama here in the dying moments as two minutes left in stoppage time here. Mount Pleasant hanging on for dear life. Tivoli Gardens knocking on the door, kicking on the door, banging on the door, heading on the door. Let's see what's going to happen here as the ball comes across inside the box. Headed out again by Campbell who has been a rock in that defense. And Tivoli Gardens again with another corner kick. McGregor, McGregor, McGregor now, still McGregor. 
wants to get this corner kick, heads it, the ball comes inside and comes inside the hand of, and, and nothing there, nothing there, nothing there, nothing there. As Newton Sterling is adjusted to a foul, the goalkeeper, nothing there, nothing there. And uh, Kadim Davis, he, he, he received the ball and Sterling just poked it out of his hand there. Referee was alert to the danger and uh, that may be the final moments in this encounter. And I'm sure that the Mount Pleasant fans will be happy to hear the final whistle right now because it's been all pressure here. We still have another minute left though in stoppage time. And if the referee is counting these moments, uh, you would want to count that as well. So. So, so Davis being treated here as the free kick now to be taken by Kadim Davis. So, here comes the free kick to be taken now, as we have 93 minutes have been played, still have another minute of stoppage time to play as it comes now with Ashley. Ashley now dispossessed by the man, Rodney now who boots it long for Rodney to chase, Rodney now to be hounded by goalkeeper Watkins, Rodney gets by him, comes down inside the box, here is Rodney now, and Rodney now to make it 2-0! And to seal the deal for Mount Pleasant, Rodney on the counter-attack has made it 2-0. And that's that for this game. Mount Pleasant will go home with all three points. He walked past goalkeeper Watkins, two defenders in the goal, knocked it into the back of the net. And that's the final whistle. That's all she wrote. Mount Pleasant, two. Tivoli Gardens, nil. That's all she wrote here at the Edward Seattle Sports Complex. Ronaldo Rodney, the man with the goal, the final kick of the match. And that has given Mount Pleasant all three points here at Tivoli Gardens. 2 nil. After succumbing enormous pressure from Tivoli Gardens, they scored with the final kick of the game to seal the three points here and to leave as the victors. Two goals to nil, Mount Pleasant, and that's the final result here, Mount Pleasant, two, Tivoli Gardens nil, and Mount Pleasant will move, Tivoli Gardens remain in 33 points, as the referee has called time on this encounter, with Mount Pleasant winning by two goals to nil. Summary of the game as we leave you is that in the 32nd minute of play, it was the man, Cardell Benbow, who popped up at the far post to give them a 1-0 lead. And in the 90 plus four minutes, the final four minutes of the piece, final minute, last kick of the game, Ronaldo Rodney got the goal there that gave Mount Pleasant their first clean sheet in five games and a 2-0 win to walk away from Tivoli Gardens as the winners here and they move up to 44 points. Winning coach, coach of and Coach, first of all, congratulations. First win in, in five games was a, a rough patch. And tell us about your, your feelings about the game overall today. In four, in, in, uh, in four games, it's, it's, a, it's a good comeback. You know, we've been struggling the last three games. You know, two against um, Aberview and, and the last one against Humberline. You know. We've been getting chances, what we've been doing in the, in the first round and been missing it. Today, we come with one mission, you know, to play hard today, aggressive. And then what, 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 what will we, we, transpire, just transpire. All right, uh, got the goal in the 32nd minute. Uh, some 
pressure uh, you had to, to succumb to some pressure there uh, close moments and we finally got the goal to go ahead the last kick of the game to win 2-0 uh, what's the feeling like especially under that period of pressure and to get that goal to sort of calm all the nerves there you know we expect this you know we are their home you know and the home team is supposed to put that pressure on the on the away team you know but it's nice for the guys the coaching staff them you know how we work together today you know and, and we got this victory all right, Rankin uh, made his debut today, had some injury concerns, had to come out in the, in the, at halftime. Also, we saw the captain, Ladiel Richie, just give us an update as to what would have caused, were those forced injuries or were those tactical changes? No, it was no tactical. Um, Ladiel has a flu and he said he can't go, he's, he's, he's dizzy. Rankin, you know, that headbutt, so he's got a hard headache, so you don't want to risk it, you know, so you have to take him out. All right, talk to us now about the next game. We, we have won this one, you are now on 44 points, two points behind the leaders. What's the plan going into the next game as you prepare the team? Well, our plan is to be in the, the top two. So, you know, I, I think we are back in a sense on, 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 the, on, the, on the streak where we want to be, on uh, that road. We win this game and that's what we want to be, keep winning till the finish. Okay, coach, thanks very much. All right, thanks. The coach of... Tivoli Gardens, Philip Williams, coach Tivoli Gardens. First of all, coach, obviously must be disappointed. Talk to us about your overall impressions on the game today. Yeah, very disappointed in that I'm um, getting um, one of the positive results from this game. I think we played well, um, uh, yeah, especially in the second half. We, we were very dominant. Um, unfortunately, we did not make it count where the goals were concerned. Um, it was a good game for us and um, very good look um, going forward in terms of the way we want the guys to play and um, where the fitness level is at, where I think we're very comfortable um, where, where that is at now. Um, we're just very disappointed playing at home and losing today the way we play. The, 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 you consider a goal in the first half, the second half you came out, you made some tactical adjustments that obviously had a positive impact on how you went forward. What do you think you know, was the, the, the main reason why you may not have gotten on the score sheet this evening? I think I think it's um in terms of um converting the chances um Mount Pleasant had a good block in front of the goal and that gave us some amount of difficulties. But I think the chances that that we got um with a little bit more luck um one of them should have would have gone in. But um the tactical changes work for us. There are some new guys that we that came over in the, in, in the trans, transfer mark, um, window and um they really really um, put on a good show for us today and it's a good look in terms of what we want going forward. First defeat in five games, you have had a good run in terms of getting yourself back to the, trying to get in the top half of the table. How does this impact that push for the top six? Correction, first defeat in nine games. Um, it's really, um, our ambition um, is to get in the top six and every point that we lose, our job right now, um, every game that we lose, our points that we drop right now, then put a dent in our, in our ambition going forward. It's coming down to the business end of the competition and um, every time you lose a game, it's, it's an opportunity loss. But uh, I can't blame the guys. We have to get this to our system. I think they played well. Well, they played well. And um, Mount Pleasant is a good team. And for us to be so, so dominant in the second half says well for us. And um, we just need to, to keep focus, keep doing what we're doing. And um, the, the results that we want will come. Final question. Talk to us about the next game and the preparations going into that one. I think the next game is against um, Waterhouse, if I'm not, not, not lying. Um, Waterhouse is, is, is not much different from, from Mount Pleasant where quality is concerned. But Tivoli, um, I think the guys have gelled now and definitely we are forced to reckon with um, right now in terms of how we present ourselves as an opponent to, to anyone that, that we play. Um, the team ambition is high in terms of the quality and the, 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 the talents that we have and um, definitely the guys will be, will, will be putting all in all the work in order for us to, to achieve our short-term objective of reaching in the top six. Coach, all the best. Thank you very much. Yeah, man. Thanks and all the best to you also.